All right. What's your drinking, Josh? Welcome back to, welcome back to the scrum. None of your fucking business. June 3rd, I am drinking a Uncle Rick's Pilsner. Nice. Oh. There you go. Nice. Shouts, Shouts out, out Uncle Rick. Shouts dude. out Uncle Rick and his Pilsners. Cody, what you sipping on? Stormbrew, I hope? Nah, I'm out. You're out, bro. So truly, truly. Off the white truly. claws under the Trulies. It's what's ever's in the fridge, dude. Whatever's in the Respect. fridge. Respect. I feel, it. I feel it. What about you, Jacob? What are you sipping on? Dude, nothing. I had water, you know, just out here being healthy, staying hydrated. It's hot outside, dude. This aqua bitch. It's hot as shit. Have it I been outside? No. Um, <laughs> decent weather, though, the past few days. Yeah. I don't know. It's like, it's, a, uh, it's like 90 lag. degrees today. Lag city, bitch. Lag, lag city, bitch. Are we back? Who was lagging? I think there was just a big – there was like a three-way delay, but I think we're uh, back. I'm just ready to get this back in person. I'm tired of all the lag. Yeah, real. pretty rough. And, you know, I think we're, we're getting close. We're getting we're very getting close. At, you know, we'll see what happens. I think maybe maybe next week. Maybe. Mm-hmm. Um, all right. So if you don't have a beverage, you have about uh, like two and a half hours to go get them or an hour and a half to go get stocked yeah. up because there's a curfew, right? Yep. Um, out 8 p.m. to 5 a.m. Yeah, there's a there's a lot of curfews. I don't know the like where they all are, but there's a mad curfews yeah. like everywhere. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? If you if you see the news, if you pay attention to anything going on, you obviously know what's going on. Uh, you know, in regards to everything happened with George Floyd and uh, the protests for the Black Lives Matter movement, um, which we fully support. You know, just to go ahead and put yeah. that out there, we fully support it um, and the protests going on for sure. But 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 do. Due to that, and and detractors, people who are people who are trying to upset these movements and 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 do harm instead of good, um, you know, are, trying to are, hijack them, hijack the right. movement, and, and and you know, and whether that's justified or not, right? That's the whole that's a whole another mm-hmm. conversation. That that slight aggression, I'll even I'm calling it slight because it's not like you know, it's not like people are breaking into people's homes and fucking you know murdering yeah. people. It's you know it's, going after it's, Target. Like, come on, bro. Target's gonna be okay. Yeah, history is not. Target not, made money. Target made money on the pandemic, bro. Like, right. <laughs> when you light when you light a fire to CVS underneath apartment buildings, not cool. Not a great look. Quick point not being cool. that people have rioted in the past, and I'm not yeah. saying that it's something we should ignore. I'm just saying that it's happened historically, right? Uh, I forgot exactly where I was going with that whole just little bit. Fucking <laughs> short-term memory loss being yeah. real out here. Um, well, I guess in, in good news, the other three officers today were charged. Um, and then the original guy who actually had his knee down, it, they upgraded his charges from third to, I think, uh, second. second degree. Yep. So that's yep. A, a good start. Good. It's a good start, um, yeah. Just got to yeah. make sure they don't try to uh, just use those four guys as a patsy. You know what I mean? Like there's like there's still a bigger issue at large. Don't just try to dump like okay, there was four bad cops. Picking up, but I think right. I heard you. Was I? Was but, it but, I mean, up? Think, yeah, I, mean, I, I heard think you. I think I heard you. But I was yeah, I was just yeah. saying that don't let those four cops just be a patsy. Like there's still a bigger issue at large that needs to be handled. Right. You know what I mean? Right. And I yeah. think I think one of the bigger issues, and and hopefully charging these three other guys will help with that, is just like accountability in general. Um, people are scared to like snitch on their fellow officer and stuff like that when that that can't be you know it's it's not acceptable so being able to now like set a precedent where these people are now charged as well will hopefully get more people to speak up whenever they see some shit like that even even socially right like amongst us like we're we're three white dudes and and we're not going to sit here in front and act like we're not. Ad- <laughs> <laughs> what the what the fuck went to this? It's happen? not like we're not adjacent to people making racist jokes, or especially more in our past when we were younger. I think we kind of have matured enough and distance ourselves from a lot of that kind of stuff. Mm-hmm. That these days, especially in these times, you'd be, yeah. you know, you you would be almost an imbecile. And I guess that's kind of where we're going with this whole thing. At least I am. Like you know, just kind of free flowing consciousness here. If you are trying to like put anything out there, like. Look, blue lives matter. All lives matter. Like trying to make those statements right now, you you have to know that you're doing you're doing an injustice, not just to like to yourself, but like society. Like you're yeah. really hurting society right now. Like mm-hmm. there's absolutely nothing wrong with swallowing whatever false bullshit pride you have and just and just listen. Listening, yeah, just listening. Listen. Because these are people who are not are not of of any sort of uh uh they're not of any black background. They're not of any minority background. They're people who, who think they have it figured out. They're people who have lived privileged, like, you know, the three of us. I don't know. Man. Yeah. 
Did you see? Uh, I'm trying to pull up the guy's name now. Uh, Grant Na- Grant Napier or something. He was a uh, oh, he was a Sacramento Kings uh, play-by-play guy, and he was recently fired for saying you know all lives matter. And it was interesting because he came out today and posted this huge think? thing. Well, so he posted this huge thing today and was like, "Look, I I, I made an ignorant comment. Like I did not." He, he was like. He admitted he had no idea that saying all lives matter took away from the Black Lives Matter movement. And he like, you know, he said that I've been doing a lot more listening than talking in the last few days. And like, I get, you know, where I was wrong, which could be a bullshit statement. But like, I mean, there are people that legitimately, you know, they, they think that, you know, they can say that all lives matter, which obviously they do, but that's not the point of what everyone's talking about right now. It's kind of like, it's kind of like the whole make America great again thing. Like if you're really out here saying that shit, there's there's definitely some underlying statements that you might you may or may not be making and maybe and that's yeah. not for everybody right i'm not sitting here trying to put people in a box because that's definitely what a lot of people are doing but let's not let's not act like uh what lends what tends to be what right i mean yeah yeah so it's all it's all some underlying statement and and yeah. people are and people are throwing that out there hard you know because it's really their only quote defense i guess right yeah and, not, well, and, that's the thing if they are being racist if that is their intent they're not they're not coming out and just saying the shit yeah. And I think people think that when people say black lives matter, that they're, that they're saying other lives don't. And like, that's not, right. that's not the thing. Like it, there's, they're saying like all lives matter. All lives don't matter until black lives do matter. You know what I'm saying? Like, exactly. we gotta, we gotta quit. Cause we, how many times we've seen it? If we're, like, on, if we're on, all since the Twitter's same, gotten big. Like, if we're all the same, one of our own's fucking down right now. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like if if like if 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 you're saying all lives matter, then then okay, then some of these other lives are, are not doing as good, man. Like yeah, pay attention. Right. If that's the case for real. Yeah. It's yeah, I mean it's just it's so it's so it's just so ignorant. Yep. And then I think so I think ignorant. the most the most frustrating thing to me is just trying to figure out the difference between the pro I mean, there is a very clear difference between protesters and the rioters. Yeah, um, and there's a lot there's of that whole lo- agent provocateur thing that is yeah been proven. I mean, there's a lot. History yeah, that- there's a lot of people like there. Yeah, I mean, there's a lot of people that are going through, and they're they're just opportunists at this point. They just see chaos, and they're like, "Oh, I'm trying mm-hmm. to get in there and mass it as well." Yeah, um, but and you're seeing the protesters stop try to stop those people doing it too. Like, dude, my one of my favorite videos downtown. was a guy who. So uh, I forget where it was. I want to say it was in Chicago or something. But people were marching, and so one guy yelled flip the truck, flip the truck. And like, everybody looked over at that guy and was like, did you just tell us to flip that car? He was like, no. And a whole bunch of people grabbed him and walked him over to the police pro- or to the police and kind of like tossed him at them and they arrested that guy. Mm. He probably just got, you know, they gave him his badge back, let him go back out on the fucking. <laughs> That's hilarious. That's hilarious. It is, it is scary though to think about, you know, some of these people that are going out there just like, there are some people who are going out to, to cause mayhem just because they're yeah. again opportunists so there are also people that are going out there off. yeah but there are also people that are going out there and smashing shit deliberately just to make the black lives matter movement look bad but yeah that's a whole nother side to it yeah like, you know, like i said that goes back to that whole agent provocateur thing if you know yeah. you if the protests are peaceful and you want to shut it down you got to make them not peaceful give you an excuse to go in there and do something about it exactly it's, but you just be like supporting the movement. You just can't let that uh, take away from, you know, your initiative, your need, desire to want to go out there and make a change. You know what I'm saying? You can't let, you can't let those pieces of shit, you know, dissuade you from right. uh, what the change we want to see made. So mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. it was wild seeing the uh, the Blackout Tuesday stuff yesterday. Um, it was but like extremely, wildfire. it was extremely surreal to like go through your entire Instagram feed and like it was nothing but black squares yeah. except for, I will say that Instagram really fucked up by allowing sponsored ads to be in there yesterday. Cause I'm Did flipping they? through I'm like, who is this piece of shit posting right now? <laughs> there's like always a sponsored ad. Yeah. Or something. yeah. And then there's the whole thing about, you know, preventing the spread of information by doing that though. And I don't think that was Doesn't Facebook on Instagram. Yes. Yep. There you yeah. go. And there's been you there's saw, been a lot you saw of what's going uh, on over there. Yeah, I would say there's been a lot of unrest at Facebook headquarters. There's a lot of people really? having problems. Yeah, there's a lot of people oh, yeah. having problems with like uh, high Bloomberg. high known people at Facebook have been like resigning from the company mm-hmm. and, and all about from, what for what for like promoting. 
Well, fucking Lizard Man won't speak out. Lizard Man's yeah. being a little bitch. <laughs> and, and, he, so, and he's he was saying, uh, I saw kind of a funny, kind of a funny headline uh, where he he had come out and made a statement saying that you know posts shouldn't be fact checked. And so like the whatever uh, news company it was, media company shouldn't be. Yeah, shouldn't. That's what he said. And they and so they came. They made their uh, the title of their article. A uh, known pedophile, Mark Zuckerberg, says that posts, that articles and posts shouldn't be fact checked. Very good. And it's yeah. like, and I, I read it, I was like, wait there. a second. He's, a, I was like, oh no, they're just, they're doing a thing there. But it got me for fucking That's half wild. a second. That's good though. That's good. It, yeah. That's good. That's a way to make a point. But, God damn. God damn, dude. Yeah. I mean, like, like we were saying, we hope there's, so, we hope there's change. So speaking like, similar to that and looking at a little bit of hockey, you know, there's, a, I, I don't know off the top of my head, the fucking list. Um, but there's definitely just a few teams who haven't spoken out. They need to. And it, it's like the one thing I'll say to that, the, the one defense to any of that I'll say is it's not that some teams, and if they're not speaking out, then they are doing a, a bad thing. They need to speak out. They need to let people know where they stand. And, and it's, just as, it's just as obvious and simple as that. If they're not yet, can we please just assume that they're trying to put together the right words or something else to, to come out and, and say what they do want to say? these things have to be done very carefully it's yeah. it may seem may seem simple but it's not as simple as just saying those words right because people look at this stuff with a microscope yeah you well want, you, right? you have but, to have actions to back it up I well not not even just that. that but before you even get that far i'm talking about just putting together a statement you got to put those words in the right order not just say them i guess is what yeah. i'm saying and so so that that does take time and they, that yeah. they put that through bullshit you can say that that's a shitty excuse but they're they want yeah. some of the teams want to get to those statements yeah that's, one the, of the, only re- that's the only thing i'll defend i think one i'm gonna go the, out and say though that i think the hurricane statement kind of sucked i think it was pretty wishy-washy one of those just tell you what it said it just uh, same with a lot of teams it's just like we stand with everybody like just not addressing the problem like you gotta you gotta address the problem it's an interesting conversation you know like a lot of them like you said you know, not a lot of them were impactful kind of cookie cutter People even responded like, okay, well, cool. So yeah, it's kind of – it's a double-edged sword where you're damned if you do, damned if you don't. And I guess that's the only reason why I would defend any pods because it's not that they don't – it all goes back to, you know, guys like Crosby who took a long time to come out and say anything, finally did mm-hmm. today, and people were people were gracious. I, I sarcastically tweeted, all right, finally Crosby ended racism. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, yeah. Yeah. But that's, that's just it. Like we depend on these guys, and a guy like Crosby, he's so, he's so up there. I mean, he's mm-hmm. so up there at the forefront of this sport, the forefront of this game uh, in the world. He needs to he needs to speak out much sooner than he did. Um, but you do have to give these individuals, organizations, especially organizations, the time to put together their words so they can say what they want to say. Right. One thing that I saw that was really interesting, and I'm sure that you guys saw it, was the post that Slavin put out. Um, obviously, because him and his wife had a, adopted a, a black daughter. Mm-hmm. Um, so he, he he made a post and was like, you know, it's – I'm kind of ashamed to say like it took me adopting a black daughter to fully comprehend like you know what the the black lives matter movement and things like that and yeah. his, his post I mean it, while yeah. it was while it was a little it was a little heavy on the Jesus side um the the <laughs> message behind it was was really good yeah it was well yeah well intentioned he beat yeah. the team to a statement yeah I did see that yeah mm-hmm. that was the first thing that I'd seen I think from anyone was he was probably wondering. he probably wanted to say it sooner yeah yeah. You yeah. know, he probably wanted to do it True. sooner and he just didn't want to make the team look worse than it already did. Yeah. And he was like, fuck it, they're taking too long. Man, I'm spitballing. I don't know. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> you don't talk to Slavin on the on the reg, dude. You That's just be... it, man. I don't I don't know shit. I'm dumb. <laughs> like I'm really dumb. And for me to be this dumb. It's pretty easy to see what is going on here and what needs to happen, and that's that's the frustrating part. When I'm when I'm this stupid and I feel like I can see the what's right and wrong here, y'all got it a prop. Some yeah, guys, some of you guys need to figure shit out. I like honestly like watching guys. all the the protests and shit this weekend, uh, in in the early part of this week. Like there are times where I just like forget about coronavirus, which is wild. Like the, the yeah. this Seeing huge a bunch thing of is going together on. will make you forget. Yeah. I think that, I think it's a huge part of why uh, this particular incident caused the explosion too, though, or just the oh, yeah. explosion of out, I agree. outcry was the fact that everyone's been sitting home, jobless, seeing their government not help them at all, and then they just you know go and kill that man on fucking in front of the whole country. Yeah, and, and I mean, I'm obviously are tired. people are tired yeah. of it, man. 
to tired your point, it's, it's not the first time it's happened. No, tired of being Obviously tired. Not, not even, not even close. I did see a good. Uh, I don't know if it was a picture, if it was a video clip that I saw, but it was of George Floyd's daughter saying something along the lines of like, "Daddy helped change the world" or something yeah. like that, which was a really powerful message to come out. Yeah, no, yeah, definitely sure. heartwarming. Definitely one of those, one of those good, good feeling posts you see right now. Definitely. Yeah. Um, and also too, uh, Brianna Taylor. Uh, the the young lady who who was also uh, and I and forgive me for not knowing all the details, but that's just kind of a name that people aren't talking about too. She was, I guess, more or less murdered too by the police. Uh, was she? Was that the EMS um, who was shot? Who was like shot in her home, and her husband tried to defend himself, and like he ended up. Was that it? Because I want to say it was in her house, but I could I couldn't put together in my head how that would have happened. But that's how fucking crazy it is, bro. Yeah. She, so she she, she was, was a, she's an EMS. She was like sleeping, got up or something. Cops started firing. The the husband or boyfriend or something fired a shot a shot back at the cops, and then he got charged for uh, unbelievable uh, killing her. Something no no no, no. Uh, something about uh, like shooting at the cops. Uh, um, yeah, yeah, there's been a lot of sick, just, there's been a lot of super sick sick stories coming out now that literally what you know, the Second Amendment is for. <laughs> yeah, for yeah. real, ability to you know what I mean? Like yeah. goddamn, dude. Yep, but and then there's all this dude. You're seeing like watching the feeds from uh, other countries, the way other countries are watching our, us on the news right now, and how it like how it's Clowns. being. Yeah, we look. Looks terrible, man. It looks real fucking terrible. Not the protesters. It is terrible. Just yeah, yeah, I'm saying the yeah not, the, not, the way that the government yeah. and the just police us are the handling. Whole. Yeah, the way it's being handled by. Yeah, and speaking of clowns, the powers that be. Well, as I was gonna say, please, please get into the Spe- whole Trump thing. Real so quick. speaking of clowns, dude, look at this. Dude, what the fuck is this guy doing? Is he filming his own movie for himself? Like, what is going on, dude? What is going on? They put out. They put out like a promo. They put out like a promo. Of him, and we were talking about it earlier, like, the only way they did that was by beating pedestrians out of the way with tear gas and yeah. fucking riot shields. From yeah. shit. Fucking guys he goes over there and takes Citadel a picture. From Skyrim and shit. This is a Bible. Like, dude, that <laughs> shit. Dude, did y'all see that? Hot when to he, the touch, I bet. Dude, when, mm-hmm. he, when he was holding that and the reporter was like, is that your Bible? He's like, this is a Bible. <laughs> like, I was like, bro, What? <laughs> I put it in this trash can where I found it. But I'm <laughs> and he was like, he was hiding in a bunker and shit. Like I, uh, a couple of days ago, Obama came out with a post. It was like a on Instagram. It was like nine fucking swipes or something. Of yeah. Context. Um, but it was just one of those things. Like I cannot believe I used to respect the president of the United States. Like please, please. Well, come usually back. in a time like this, you would hear from him. You'd see him more. You, yeah. you know what I'm saying? He'd be addressing the people, not turning yeah, all the lights off at people. the White House and right. stuff. But yeah. Speaking of cowards, dude. <laughs> Transition. What's up? Like, all right. Like, what's wrong? What's wrong with us? Like, what's wrong with us? Besides the fact that we're white, what's what's <laughs> wrong? And and male. I mean, those are those are problems. What's what's wrong with us? Where people don't want to play video games with us, dude? Oh yeah, dude. The fucking because every- y'all are trash, man. You lose every game. Dude, be- are we that bad? They probably think that way. They don't want to look at all the stats, though. You know what I'm saying? The, the games, except for that first game, bro. Every game's been close, except for the very first scrimmage game we ever ran together as a team. Everything's been close. Yeah. Had yeah. old dude quit. I whatever is whatever his name is. I can't even remember now. Quit the you're, team. Like you're you're a fucking clown. Like <laughs> like it's a it's a thing where you're supposed to like you you signed up to be part of a draft where you get pulled together with people to play a video game online and just fucking vibe and you could not not be away from your fucking buddies that bad to where you fucking had to play you know you can play together when the tournament's not going on right yeah. no one's keeping dude. you guys it's not like you guys can't talk to each other dude they're, they're taking it dumb serious man you know you know dude it's cancellation I mean, it's the same cup, fucking, man. i'm not Top even front prize. same team that fucking cheated last year and brought in randoms that weren't even on their team it's true that, it's true that desperate like it's just yeah. sad yeah, calling us but, a fucking dumpster fire. Go fuck yourself. Yeah. Like, <laughs> and dude, like, apparently though, they like uh, uh, Reed was saying he. I think this is the team that Reed's going to play uh, threes with. Uh, I'm I'm, I'm, I'm well, not calling Reed with, out here. No, yeah, I think he's playing with uh, James's team. That's under review. That's uh, okay. But um, 
So, so, so there's enemies on all teams. Oh, here. dude, everyone's sending shots. Dude, everyone's sending dude. shots at us. Free but, fucking smoke. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> but uh, he was saying he hopped in and played with them for a little bit, just like late the other night, uh, just to play some games. And he was saying like he got in the chat with them, and they were like, "Hey, man, no. so just so you know, like we're taking this pretty serious. Like we're trying to win this whole thing. Like." And he was just like, "Oh, okay, you know, I'll, I'll take this." online video game local tournament pretty serious you guys like let's just so. say this man let's just say this if if we're even still involved next season which i'd love to this is this was kind of our brainchild and i know sterling and chris have been a, a nothing but bigger assets than yeah. i and getting huge this shout off out the to ground them. definitely huge yeah, shout absolute out massive shout out to them if we continue to be involved there's gonna be some goddamn vetting going on in this next uh, upcoming <laughs> yeah. draft here we're gonna do some fucking weeding you know what i'm saying yeah, Cut the yeah. grass you know what, you know what I'm, saying? I'm saying keep that grass cut low bro keep it low you know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? eyes on them snakes you know yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> absolutely dude it's all good i mean rightfully so we deserve all the trash talk we fucking suck oh we're trash we're, we're trash it's a new but season, it's a new season. You know, hey you better. know what would help though you know what would help the sucking factor if my first fucking draft pick in the exposed expansion draft decided to play for the team it does all who had 41 assists last season me thinking like oh wow our team might not be total shit this year yeah it would if help if decide the, to if hang the talent around showed up yeah then you won't be like, hey, how about this? Then you won't be on a trash team if you just yeah. stick around, stupid motherfucker. Yeah. <laughs> and even, like, dude, even Reed on our team was like, yeah, man, I signed up for this tournament because my buddy told me about it. And he was like, my buddy told me, he's like, don't worry about it. I'm, I can guarantee that we'll be on the same team together. And then they weren't. He got drafted, Reed got drafted to us. And he was like, and that just is what it is. Like, he was like, I'm just going to show up and play because – it's a fucking video game. Like, like, and that's the whole thing. Like, it's not that like it's not that like you want to play with your buddies. You can't play with your buddies. It's just like the. I'll, it's like it's just kind of disrespectful. Not just like I like I don't care about me. Like to you guys too. Like everyone on the team. Like you're just telling us flat out. Yeah, I don't. I don't want to play with you. I'm yeah. not. Well, no, he like, didn't. He rude. didn't tell us flat out. That's that's the rude part. Oh, he DM me. He after a. No, after, you're right. You know what I'm saying? No, you're after, right. I had to hear, he was, I had to hear yeah. five ways first. I had to tell that chat to hit me up like a man. You're right. Yeah. No, you're right. Like, how about he actually comes and asks, tells me, like, hey, instead of just ghosting our chat. But whatever, oh. dude. I hope he deals with that separation anxiety. Yeah. <laughs> Quits fucking barking and whining whenever he gets too far away from his boy, dude. For real, dude. All right. That's, that's enough of that. <laughs> I guess this has can, been the scrum. <laughs> it, 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 it's, it's been the scrum, bro. Shouts out Spets before we leave. Yeah, exactly. Some, 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 let's, there's, there are some positive vibes in there. We yeah. got to find them. Spets uh, donating uh, hand sanitizer and masks to the local Boys and Girls Club. Am I yeah, right? I, I that? believe so. Yep. Um, yep. So and that he was talked good about his brother. Yep. Yeah, they were both been together. I think they're both I think, you know. Evgeny's, Evgeny's like, yes, yeah, Fetch is making the, the, the real money. I got to go. <laughs> His apartment's – he's got the two-bedroom apartment right now. Sounds like my younger brother. <laughs> uh, oh, shit. You're saying yeah. Dylan's no, Speaking Andre, of making dude? all the money – well, speaking of all the money, dude. No, that's not what I'm saying. <laughs> speaking of all the money, dude, you know what I'm saying? It's, it's getting tough out here. I had to – you know, it's some wire, dude. I'm hard. I'm hard, hard wired. Hard wired in. in. I stay you know wired, bro. I yeah, stay dude. broke. I'm, I'm all a machined about, in man. Dude, I'm a, I'm an audiophile and auxiliary cords are much are much, offer a much higher quality of sound going to the recipient, you know what I mean? I'm just I saying because our views have gone down due to all this, everything going on, mainly obviously just the coronavirus it's hurt our views. And yeah, for uh sure. For sure, not that we just don't suck anyway, but it you know is what, what it is. We suck on uh, we suck on all fronts. I really dude. I really hope people don't I really pe- hope people we don't, don't need a pandemic project to suck, okay? Your, like your your cancellation cup team has been projected onto this entire podcast now. People just what, stop paying attention. Really, it's just it just speaks to the quality of me as a man. Like this is this is like the art I put out. You know, not that you guys don't contribute. But I put, this is my art. This is my art. It's this is my art. My vision. <laughs> this is this is my this is my video game team. We suck. I'm a husband. I suck. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Dude, it's all we're gonna get through this together, dude. At least, hey, at least the rest of the podcast, you know, sticks around though. You know what I'm saying? You ask, you know, you asked us to be a part of this, and we were like, Yeah, we're we said, yeah, we're gonna be a part of this. We said and yes, then we and then we're like, through. You know what I mean? It's kind of crazy when people do that these days. I don't know. Shouts out having a word, bro. 
<laughs> you are only as good at it. <laughs> it's true. You're only as good as you were. That's what I've always been That is been fucking told. hilarious. Dude. I love that. You've, I've always said it. <laughs> <laughs> always said it. I've always said it. Yo, uh, uh, well, so we, we obviously are going to get some retorts if anyone decides to view this, which they won't. But they if, won't. if they do decide to retort, we're screaming into the void. We can get, they can talk some shit back to us because Darren Dreger hasn't been adding us. Uh, at Talking Sauce Pod, no underscore, respect the underscore. Uh, check us out on Spotify, uh, Cancellation Cup on Twitter. We're going to be streaming again, and you can get that at J A Y C O B B B 77. You can get me at the same at with an underscore J A Y underscore C O B B B 77. Josh, where can they get you at? Jacob's over here giving the access codes to the bunker in Verdansk and shit. With this fucking <laughs> Teebs, T-A-B-Z-Z. Cody, where they get you at? Uh, CD underscore 2187. And you can get Dylan. Everyone knows it by now. It's the, the with your mom and 420, 69, T-bags, XX, something. something, like that. something in, regard, in regards to everything going on, take care of each other, love one mm-hmm. another. Black lives do matter. And if you mm-hmm. feel like you're obligated to donate or, or protest, Take some do, action, sign petitions, yeah. do something. You know what I'm saying? Yep. Don't There's just... a lot of good, good, uh, good organizations and yeah. funds being put together right now. Yep. They're all over everyone's timeline. Find them. We're retweeting yeah. some of them. Yeah. Uh, don't so hit those shits up. Yeah. So don't just don't post for the it. sake of posting. You know what I'm saying? Exactly. That's and you're gonna notice. Not that we have much to say, but we're posting less. Yeah. For good reason. Yeah. Like give the There's give the moment, give the moment to the movement. Give the moment yep. to the movement. 